All right, today I'm at Sonic trying the new Chop House cheeseburger. If you're new to my channel, I am Kathy and I try things and give you my two cents. All right, so I'm not gonna lie, this is my second time trying this. I actually tried it yesterday, as you can see here. Um, but when I got home to edit it, there was sound issues, so I'm back. So we'll see how it is day two. See if it, ooh, the bun's better today. The bun is better. The cheese isn't as melty. Let me show you. Let me show you. So this is a 100% pure seasoned beef patty with two slices of American cheese, bold, chop house aioli, and crispy onion string served on a toasted brioche bun. I am a fan of the brioche bun. Let me see what the onions look like today. They look about the same as yesterday. And that's the problem with these crispy onion straws. I or strings they're calling them. I do love them, but you put them on a burger and they get soggy. I'm gonna try one. Ah, ah. Mm. That was yummy. That just made a mess. Oh, all right, so. So oh, mine yesterday didn't have this much aioli on it. See, as you can see, that is a, that's a lot. That is a lot on there. It does have a little bit of a kick to it. Not like super spicy, but if you're not a fan of spicy, it, um, it may be too spicy for you. I would like the cheese a little bit meltier, but Give it another try today. I don't think mine had as much aioli on it as did yesterday. So the burger, it looks a little crispy on the outside, but it's not, it doesn't taste dry at all, but I do like the edges to be a little crispy on my burger. To be honest, I think the burger and the cheese and the aioli take over, overpower the taste of the onion straws. Because, you know, separate, you know, I just took one off. I could try it. And I can get the onion flavor. But with it all together, I'm really not getting much of an onion flavor at all. Just the aioli. I mean, there's definitely not as many onion strings. Is that what they're called? Onion? Onion strings. Um, as they're showing on the, on the advertisement for this burger. Um... It almost looks like they're, this is a little thicker. It almost looks like an onion ring. I was expecting them to be a little thinner. I don't know, maybe not. And the cheese is melted on the burger, just the part that's hanging off, is it? Um, yeah, the Chop House aioli, um, I tried to look to see if I could find the ingredients in it and I couldn't find it. Um, Cause I want to know what the little, the, the heat is. So overall, I think it's a really good burger. Um, it does have a lot of calories. If you don't want to see, close your eyes. I will show it here. So yeah, um, I'm going to have to do some extra working out today. That's for sure. But, um, like I said, I like the burger. I like that it's crispy, crispier on the edges, but it's not dried out at all. It could use some more onions to me because, uh, I think I need more to get the flavor, um, because just the aioli and it, cheese and everything is taking over trying to figure out what's in there but yeah it does have a little a little bit of a kick to it not much if you like spicy things it probably it's not even probably be noticeable to you um i like some heat not a lot but it there is something there that is adding a little a little heat so i think it's good you know the aioli adds a little something different instead of just you know your typical mayonnaise or mustard ketchup. I give it a four out of five. I think the onions could be better on it. There could be more. Um, because like I said, I'm really not tasting that. I kind of like this one better than yesterday. Yesterday, the bottom bun was a little hard and that's going to happen. Uh, like I've said many times, this isn't like a bag of chips that everyone's going to be exactly the same. You know, every location, even though they try to be the same, you don't know who's cooking it. Do they had a bad day? Do they not want to know what they're doing? Haven't been trained? 
whatever the case. So it may not be exact. So the price for the Chop House cheeseburger is $5.09. Mine was $5.59 with tax. So I know everything's everything's up these days, which it's a similar little high. So right now on the Sonic app, you all know how I love the Sonic app. Um, you can get two for five. It's so can get two for five um, Fritos, uh, the chili cheese wraps, two for five on the quarter pounder double cheeseburgers. And the regular price on these is like $2.99. So two for five, you're getting a dollar off, which hey, it's a dollar. Uh, I could buy you a drink if you're using the app because you could have price drinks. Sonic really needs to hire me to promote this app because I'm always talking about this app. I'll forgive them that they turned me down for the commercial, but they want me to, you know, promote this app. I can do that. I know they do it on the commercial a little bit, but not as much as they should because the Sonic app is probably the fast food app that I use the most um, to get drinks basically. But it's easy to order and it's easy. Um, I like it because usually I customize my burger if I come to Sonic. So it's easier to do on the app than it is, you know, talking to a box. So yeah, so if you don't have, the, if you like Sonic and you don't have the app, you should get the app. Give it a try. And usually when new things come out, you can get them half price. I was waiting for this burger to be half price, but it's not. So I'm not sure if they're going to offer that. I know they have the half price for the churro shake. It's just a one time. But uh, if you want to get the churro shake and try that, which is really good, um, you can get that if you have the app. So anyway, enough about the app. Back to the burger. I recommend the burger four out of five. I think it's good. It is out until the end of October, I believe. So yeah, if you want to give it a try, um, head over to Sonic, but get your app first. Your app first. Doesn't sound right. So if you try the Chop House cheeseburger at Sonic, let me know what you think of it in the comments below. And I have a question for you today. If you can only have one condiment on your burger, what would it be? One condiment forever, only one. Is it mayo, mustard, ketchup, relish? What is it? I'm gonna say mayo. Mine is, or ranch. Oof, ranch. I'm gonna go mayo. Mm, ranch. That'd be a really good, I'm gonna say mayo. Mayo is my one condiment. If that's the only condiment I could have forever, it would be on a burger, it would be mayo. All right, let me know what your condiment would be in the comments below. I really appreciate you watching. I hope you have a wonderful day and I will see you next time. Bye.